Good afternoon, welcome to Showbiz here on Joy News Today. Now, multiple award winning musician Kwabna Kwabna has outlined his plans for this year. Speaking in an interview with Joy Entertainment, the musician says he has three singles to be released ahead of his annual Valentine show. To give the fans a feel of the album and experience almost every song on it. So, what's going to happen is I'm going to give you guys three play. Three songs for Valentine. <laughs> okay, so that's, that would be in February. If no, it <laughs> will be that. it will be before Valentine. So I'm I'm gonna release those songs for you, for you to actually soak it, it's for you to gear you up to my Valentine concert. I mean Corona boy, COVID boy. I mean our Valentine concert is coming back in February. So you know I'll give you some songs to actually feed on before I meet you in February. We from Kwapna Kwapna musicians Kwame Yuji and Kitty have expressed excitement at holding their first concert at the Indigo O2 Arena in the United Kingdom. According to them, it's every industry player's responsibility to project the Ghanaian sound, thus, they are taking the initiative. So, what we can do is come together, work together. Charlie, when we all become big, you can decide, that, okay, man, me do man, me do see. But as we're all now coming, we need to learn from what the others are doing right. You know, instead of fighting, and I think like, the good like, things like from you ask, yeah. it needs to be done. Somebody has to do it. Mm. Maybe it, it would have taken, I mean, some time, but it needed to be done. Mm. We, we can't just sit there and hope that if not, as somebody will do it, Charlie, we too will be people. Mm. So, once it's been able to be, I mean, some people are, are, are doing it. I mean, we've been in London to support other Nigerian acts before. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We were backstage at Mayor Kohn's concert. It was an amazing. We were talking about, wow, when are we having our wedding? We were having plans, actually. We have something like this. And we saw how much uh, um, every, every, most of the Nigerians were backstage trying to gas the guy that, wow, this is amazing. And, and I remember I saved a video on, I saved a video on, on, Instagram mm. of Shopsido, if you know Shopsido, yeah, yeah. After CK's performance on Whiskey's concert, and they were all like, "Yeah, we are waiting for your concert." Away from that, a musician Fancy Gadam has revealed that he is the only artist from the north who has never had any beef with his colleague artists for attention. He spoke uh, to KMJ on Showbiz Now. But they forget say everybody having people. Mm. Everybody having people. Okay. My people are Gadam Nation. You understand? And yeah. they support Fancy Gadam, but nobody. Like, they see Fancy Gadam like, like a king. Mm. Like, they see Fancy Gadam, they don't see anybody when it comes to, you know, sections, when it comes to like. Even, even at, at, at North, they don't, they don't see any other musician apart from you. Uh, there's Macasio. There's oh, there's a lot of artists. Yeah, yeah, that a lot of artists. Doing well. I mean, in the any... world. You know, uh, what, what are you talking about? The world? Why are you, uh, oh, no, to? because that is where you have the major fan base. So I'm looking at yours. Even with all the sections, they don't yeah, see all the sections. All of, they don't see all the sections. The Gadam Nation see only fans together. <laughs> you know, everybody has his, his, uh, his nation. My is Gadam Nation. And you have the biggest nation. I tell you, man. We're all in the world. So I don't find. Fancy Gadam right there. Good afternoon to you, Izzy.